Hey guys, welcome. In this video, we are going to understand how you can use fetch as a async await. Remember that in the last video, I have explained how to use fetch as a promise. For that, you have to put async here in front of function. You have to use async in front of function. Here, you need to create a const response equal to here. You need to put await also. So like this, I need to use it. Then after that, I say const data equal to await. Again, I use response.json like this. It will also wait. Then I say console.log. I say data. Remember that if I'm using async await, I have to put async here, await here, and then await for this also. Then print data and I'm calling this function. So I say fetch info async. This is the function name. I'm calling this, I'm not calling this function, but this function have example of promise. This function have a same example of async await. So here I say node fetch, run it, and you will see that again, same data we have. So you can use either async await or you can use either promises, depend on you. That's all here. Thank you for watching it.